Hey guys, I'm Simitoskin, and welcome to Operate Now Tonsil Surgery. I'm glad you guys enjoy the surgery games. I really like playing them, and I want to do the surgery one for the tonsils here. The surgery one for the tonsils, because I never had my tonsils taken out. I still have mine, and I was always kind of curious about what, you know, what happens. I got mono once back in the day, so I only have like half a tonsil over here, and like another little half over here. Anyway, let's just jump into it. Operate. I like this music, too. It's just so... So serious. Warning, this game contains graphic depictions of surgery. Meet Scott. Scott had tonsils. Tonsillitis? <laughs> I was like, wait, he only had tonsils? Tonsil had tonsillitis. He doesn't have any more, though, because he had it. This caused an infection in the tonsils. It's called tonsillitis. To avoid complications, we must operate and remove the tonsils. I really tried to pick that apart, but I failed. Okay, doctor, let's get the patient to the operating room. It should be one of the three rooms. Hmm. No, nope, no, nope, sorry, that's the wrong one. I like how they give you this option. Like, you're doing a throat surgery, so you should take him to the heart one, right? Okay, let's get in there. Please select the anesthes anesthetic mask. All right, buddy, here you go, go to sleep. Just <laughs> sucks on there. Oh, we gotta crank up the juice. Please concentrate, sorry, what happened? Now let's wait for the patient to fall asleep. Perfect. Great work, doctor. Now you must select the breathing tube from the table. Oh, the breathing tube, yeah, we got him. He's asleep. He's gotta be able to breathe. <laughs> oh, no, I felt that. I felt that go all the way in. Oh, it's like a little booger hanging out. Uh, please select the retractor from the table. Uh, alright. Oh yeah, buddy. Open that mouth up. Open wide. Good, now we're ready to remove the tonsils. I figured they'd put like a big plastic thing over your face like But maybe not. Let's operate on the t Oh, I can see them in there. They look gross. Oh. Oh, your, your tonsils are nasty, dude. What have you been doing? Oh, you got like... Oh, so nasty. Max, my... It's like, whenever I play these surgery games, like, whatever's wrong, I, like, feel it. Like, I feel like my tonsils are infected now. Ah. All right. Do we spray with water? Let's see. Four steps from the table. Okay. Where are they at? There they are. Very good, doctor. Now use the forceps to grip the left tonsil. I'll grab that thing. Bam! Oh, ah! Oh, it's like a freaking... Ugh. Now select the cauterizer. We're gonna burn that mug out. Turn it on. Okay, I can do that. Okay, like the power. Counter must reach 20. Maximum power! Cut, cut the tonsil. Okay. Uh oh. Got time limit now. Let's cut her again to cut the other side. Ah! Very good. Now select the, the guillotine clamp. What? A guillotine clamp? That sounds bad. Oh, man, look at this thing. What is this? You, like, wrap it around it and cut it. Yep, that's what happened. Oh, he's bleeding. Okay, a few veins have begun to bleed. This is nothing to worry about. Just use the cauterizer. Oh, okay, I gotta burn burn these back in. It's like why you don't why your hand doesn't bleed if it gets chopped off with a lightsaber, because it's cauterized. Okay, now I must remove the other tonsil. Please look the forceps. Yeah, we can do this again. Whoa, what 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 what? Oh, that's not the right sorry, forceps. Why is he dying? I just I tried to pick the wrong thing and he corrected me. There's no sense in him trying to die. Please select color. Yeah, okay. okay. We did this once already. And cut. And and then we guillotine this thing. Off with his head. Oh, that's so gross. Ah, oh, okay, now we gotta cauterize it. Now your throat is wide open. Let's look at the water spray. Oh, you need some water. It's probably pretty dry in there. Oh, he's drowning! <laughs> uh, now we must select the surgical uh, suction. Oh, okay. Yeah, we gotta, we gotta get that water out. Let's remove the retractor. Okay. Oh, there you go, buddy. And now we get to... Oh, the, ah, <laughs> Excellent, doctor. Now we have to go to the hospital's pharmacy. We must select... Okay, let's give him some steroids. Just give him a boost. <laughs> some lung stuff. All right, this is ibuprofen for your throat. Been great, doctor. Liquid ibuprofen uh, can be taken every six hours. 
to hydrate the throat and help suppress pain. I'm sure the patient will recover in no time. Yes! We did it! Now, ooh, we get to play as a special. Let's go, let's try this again, see if I can do it without making any mistakes. All right, Scott, welcome back. We have to take out your tonsils again. Uh, oh yeah, no, I have to put you to sleep first. I was about to try to open your mouth while you're awake. All right, let's crank this mug to full blast. Yeah, buddy, go to sleep. I'm about to chop them tonsils out in a record time. Uh, oh yeah, I gotta help you breathe. Ah. <laughs> uh, now we gotta open your face. Open up, buddy. There's your nasty tonsils again. How'd these grow back? This is amazing. Um, this is where I just grab them, right? Yeah. Grab that tonsil out there. Turn it on. Crank it up to 11. Or 20. Just melt it out of there. Yeah, give me a, a guillotine clap. Nurse! Get that rotten piece of flesh out of here. It's so nasty. All right. Now I gotta do the other one. So intense. It's supposed to be a pretty simple procedure. That's what I heard. That it's just it's not that big of a deal. You just grab it, burn it, and then you guillotine it. Guillotine it. Get that thing out of there. All right. Now we gotta. Burn it back in. Perfect. Uh, what do we do? A drilling shot? I think we're supposed to spray him in the water, right? Drown him real quick. Wash off any excess blood in the back of the throat. Uh, this thing, right? Yeah, surgical suction. Alright. Uh, oh, it's telling me what to do. And I need that back with all your snot on it. Now I should give you some steroids. Give some of that. Oh yeah! Mistakes? None. But it still takes off some points. How dare you? My time was pretty good. My score? I did pretty good. Oh, an exclusive. Really? I got an exclusive? Let me view it. Where did it, where'd it go? Select. Oh. Uploading avatar. What does this do? Upload failed. Well, fine! Whatever. Whatever. You jerk. Go back to the serious business. So that's tonsil surgery. So, if you have to go undergo tonsil surgery every in your life, it, uh, it looked pretty quick. I mean, these, of course, these surgeries always take longer in real life than they do in this game, but, hmm, excuse me. Like, you just like, go in there and grab it and, like, pull it out. It's probably the part that now the cutting it out is probably the sore part. You're right. I was gonna say like pulling on it, it probably makes it pretty sore too, but like, you know, clamping it, pulling it out and just burning both sides. And then taking that little sharp wire, like the Hitman choke wire, just popping that little mug out and throwing it in the trash. Yeah. But yeah, I had a, I had mono back in the day. Back when I was in college, I got mono. And you know, it's like, oh, okay, and you got mono, are you kissing on some girl? <laughs> Actually, I got it from a dude, but I wouldn't kiss it on the dude. I was in band, and uh, a guy had mono, and he played my instrument, but he used his own mouthpiece. But, so when you play an instrument in the band, you, you spit all in it. And so, his infectious mono spit was all in my, my trombone. Or was it a tuba that I played at that time? Sousaphone. Anyway. <laughs> and so, uh, I got it. And it was terrible. Like, I kept having to go to the doctor, and they're like, you have strep throat. I was like, I don't have strep throat. Because they kept treating me for strep throat, and the strep throat wouldn't go away. And eventually, I went to see a specialist. And they're like, yeah, dude, you got mono. Jesus. <laughs> this stuff's dangerous. Here, take this. Take some steroids. And I got buff. JK, I got, uh, I got over it. And my girlfriend at the time... You know how girls are. I was like, I was getting better, and like, give me kisses. And I was like, I'm, 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 I'm better, or I'm good, but I don't think it's gone. Like I didn't have any symptoms anymore. And then of course she got it. <laughs> put, put her in the hospital. And I was like, yeah. Anyway. <laughs> but so now my tonsils are kind of like, like I think it's the left one. Like it's just like this little 
just this little bitty mound, like the the mono like pretty much ate it. And the right one's got like a hole in the inside of it. So if I ever do get like sick, like a little pus ball will form inside the hole in there. It's just gross. Maybe I should have my tonsils removed. Maybe it'd make my voice deep and sexy. I don't think it actually has anything to do with your voice box though, does it? Just up here. Maybe it open up your throat so you can breathe better. Maybe I wouldn't choke him on spit so much. Anyway, <laughs> rambled enough. That's operate now, tonsil surgery. I'm gonna call these surgery Sundays. Try to do one every Sunday because you guys seem to like them and I like playing them. Let me know down in the description what surgery you'd like to see next. There's a lot of them. We're gonna do them. Today's your birthday. Happy birthday. We'll see you guys next time. Stay toasty, my friends.